Hello everyone, welcome back to Let's Play Duke Nukem 3D, Episode 3, Level 7, Fahrenheit. I'm off to Mantoid, and we're starting this map out in a suburban area at least. Unlike in the last one, we were kind of in a train station. Will you die? Thank you. some shells. Uh, we'll get them later. You can drop down here. And of course, as soon as you swim, you know, down here, you'll get ambushed by Octobrain, so... Because they know you're coming. They're not stupid. The frickin' Octobrain! Come on, what do you want from them? So pick up the blue key there. And some pipe bombs. Which I'm now full on pipe bombs. Awesome. Come get some. Unlocked. Yes. Now this part is a bit uh, problematic because of what's in here. Wow, I managed to actually take care of those sentries without uh, having any of them blow up on me. I'm now proud of myself. Alright, so, climb to the over here and. Whoa! Yeah, that's one way to do it. Alright, let's climb this back up here again and take out that. <laughs> Almost had a chain gun ammo. If you jump to the top here, you can get up here and pick up this atomic health. This is fun. Whoa, don't get swept up by the water. Blast the bottles. Oh, well, we kind of already did that, I guess. Or they did it, maybe. There were some bottles on a shelf right there. So, whoa! <laughs> that kind of caught me off guard. And, uh, somebody has way too much free time. There's a couch and, uh, four TVs. So that's so he can watch his four porn videos at the same time. No kidding. There are four women up there. Oh, yeah. Almost forgot. Second secret. Wahaha. Alright, so. Next. Oh, I'm going in the wrong way here. We can come back through here. Just die, thank you. All right, chain gun ammo, sweet. All right, in this part, get your RPG out and snipe around the wall there. And if you aim right, you can actually just uh, blow open the wall that you need to go through. So, jump up here for a hollow duke and some shotgun shells. RPG, quickly jump out. This part is fun, if I remember right. Ow. That didn't feel too good. Once you get up here, you can kind of see where you've been. Guilty. And 
that just lowers the uh, the fireman's pole, and you can pick up a key card. Since you know, this is the fire hall apparently. And of course, for some reason, they have the key to KTIT, the radio station. See, KTIT. switch weapons and just have a little bit of fun. Because, uh, poor Freezer hasn't gotten a whole lot of, uh, action here. Kick already. By the way, that's like the easiest, this is the easiest secret next to one of the ones in, uh, Red Light District. You just walk in here, and it's a requirement because you need the red key. So. I like how the door has, uh, T minus 260C. Uh, I don't know what that means. Doesn't matter. Anyway. Wow. He still managed to get the, the missile off. Who wants some? This is KTIT. KTIT. Playing the breast are the best tunes in town. Oh, Duke. You so silly. Pick up an atomic health. Finally, open up here, and you are greeted with a ton of sentry droids. So that's all of the uh, sentry drones. Now to use that last key over here. Holy shit! Thank God their bullets can't go underwater. Oh, door is shut. God! Obviously, I blew up the cracked wall in the back. <laughs> well, that was, uh, painful. At least they give us an RPG back here. I might need some, uh, Devastator ammo, so I'm gonna go run and pick some up before I finish the map. Because, you know, that did hurt and all. Devastator... Freeze thrower, no. Mm, let's see if we can't find any more in here real quick. Because knowing my luck, there's probably like... Wait, wasn't there? No, that was Freeze Thrower. Hey, there it is. Come get some. I think that was it for Devastator in this map. Nope, there was some. Alright, well that is it. So now we're gonna go exit. And of course, you know, if you're low on health, you can come up here and pick these up. But anyways, that's the end of this map. Fahrenheit. I don't know where it gets its name from. I'm assuming the fire station. But this place has a lot of nasty traps, particularly early on with all the sentry drones. And then towards the end with all the sentry drones. Not to mention that there's the two mini battle lords guarding the exit. And of course, you know... If you're not expecting them, they can just tear your face off. As usual, though. I mean, they are mini battle lords. It's a sort of smallish map, but it's not so small that, you know, it's... You know, I mean, you're gonna just plow through it in no time. 
some of the monsters are very nicely placed. Except for the sentry drones, but nobody loves sentry drones. They're kind of like the lost soul of Duke Nukem. Except they're more lethal and they explode. And actually do damage by exploding. I don't really have much to say. Um, the fire hall is uh, not too bad. And, of course, you know, the radio station isn't too bad either. But, if you're, like I said, if you're not expecting certain things in this map, it can be really problematic, so. Rip on my new one. With that, we will see you in Hotel Hell. Till then, I'm Ultima Mantoid with Let's Play Duke Nukem 3D. Take care, and have fun.